Elsewhere in the topics, an elderly Kaohsiung County resident has had a hard time regaining her footing since last year's 8 day floods damaged her home. Fortunately, city volunteers came to her aid, bringing not only emotional support but also material support as well. Around five CD volunteers are loading a bed frame and mattress onto their recycling truck to begin a journey up the mountain. The road is so slippery that the truck glides over some patches. After traveling for more than 100 kilometers and spending over an hour on the road, volunteers finally arrived at Chen Liang Yu's house in Jianshan Village, Kaohsiung County. They live at the engineering school after the flooding last year, and her son went to Ida Hospital to get treatment for liver cirrhosis. That's how we found out about them, so we visited. As volunteers get rid of the old saggy mattress, the grandchild smiles happily and eagerly helps the volunteers lay down the new bed sheets. The bedding has all my favorite colors. It looks very clean and refreshing. I can't get a job. We are very happy that you care a lot about us. Following last year's flooding, Chen San passed away from liver failure. The grandmother was then forced to care for her grandson alone. Luckily, city volunteers came to their aid, bringing not only spiritual support, but also some daily necessities. When I grow up, I want to be just like Ziji, always helping people in need. 